and McPartland gets best friend to collect dog from his wife. And McPartland has returned from the I'm a celeb jungle to his rented home and let his best friend collect his dog from his wife instead of dropping in to get it himself. And, 42 who has battled addiction problems was seen arriving at the Boltel today a few streets away from his £6 million marital home. The star's Labrador Hurley shared with wife Lisa Armstrong had been their main point of contact as they battled to save their 23-year relationship. But on Saturday it was Ant's TV sidekick and best pal December who dropped the dog off. Declan Donnelly returns the dog to the star. An onlooker said, December has been acting as the go-between and has been helping Ant a lot. He brought Hurley round to the flat for Ant as he settles into his new place. Normally Ant goes to pick up the dog himself but this time he didn't. And looked glum on Friday night as he left the house. But he enjoyed a night out on December before returning to the pound 1.6 million four bed house yesterday. Workman later delivered a new double mattress to the house. And gets a mattress delivered. Nikki Wheeler married to Ant's TV presenter pal Jonathan Wilkes also paid him a visit while makeup artist Lisa prepared for the final of Strictly Come Dancing. Nikki was also seen giving Ant a farewell hug before he flew to Australia to film the ITV Jungle series last month. Lisa and Ant met in 1994 on a smash hits tour in Newcastle. And was 18 and one half of music act PJ and Duncan with December. Lisa was 17 and part of the band Juice. Anthony McPartlin and Lisa Armstrong in January this year. They dated for 11 years before Ant proposed in Dubai in April 2005. They married a year later at a country church in Taplow, Bucks, with December as best man. And made an OB in January for services to broadcasting spoke openly about his addiction battle in June and revealed he had been diagnosed with clinical depression. And admitted becoming hooked on booze and a cocktail of drugs including trimadol, morphine, diazepam and codeine after painful knee surgery went wrong. He realised he needed help when he had to be rushed to hospital after begging Lisa to call an ambulance. And said, I was at the point where anything prescription drugs, non-prescription drugs I would take. And take them with alcohol, which is ridiculous. The doctors told me, you could have killed yourself. 